Hello and welcome to the January 8, 2010 video version of Invested Central's Chart of the Day. I'm Tom Boley, Invested Central's Chief Market Strategist, and it's my pleasure to provide you with today's Chart of the Day. This Chart of the Day is brought to you by StockCharts.com, <clears throat> simply the web's best financial charts. Well, this morning we are featuring SRE Sempra Energy. This is a $13.3 billion utility company that engages in the development of energy infrastructure, operation of utilities, and provision of energy-related products and services worldwide. Um, if you take a look at the chart here, you'll see that, number one, uh, SRE had bottomed back in early March with the overall market. SRE traded back at about $35 then and has moved all the way up with some uh, bumps along the way, but it moved all the way up to $57, which it reached just before the end of 2009. We were overbought though when we got up to $57. You take a look, the RSI had gotten up to 70. Stochastics were up near 100. And as a result, the stock really did need a pullback, which we've seen over the last few days. Now, volume has been heavy on the move down, but we haven't lost any key support levels. Um, as you can see on Thursday, SRE did put in a doji, which is a reversing candlestick off of this downtrend. That gives us some hope. Um, or maybe more than just hope that SRE will reverse here and move back to the upside. Also, I think it's interesting to point out that the um, low today, or excuse me, the low on Thursday went down below the 50 day moving average and also down below this price support level. You can see this was a recent resistance uh, level at about 53.50 or so. We broke out above that in early December on a little bit of increasing volume. We've gone back and we've retested it once before and it's held. So we've got some pretty good price support in here as well as the 50-day moving average. And on an intraday basis on Thursday, SRE was below both of them before reversing back at the end of the day. So again, we think it's a fairly low risk play, low risk in the sense that if this is a reversing candle, then you shouldn't violate the bottom of this candle, which was today at a low of 52.91. You could give it a little bit more room uh, down to this gap support area, maybe around 52.50 or so, but uh, you should be able to keep a fairly tight stop on this one. To the upside, if it does reverse, we would look for it to make its way back up near $57 to retest the recent high. Now the MACD was looking good on the last high, so as we've pulled back, we see the MACD dropping, but it's still well above the center line, so we're okay with that. And again, as I mentioned earlier, the volume was pretty heavy, but we did not uh, make any major breakdowns on this move today. We were able to reverse by the end of the day. So I think that uh, SRE looks like it is poised to make a move back to the upside as we head into Friday trading. Uh, I want to uh, thank you for tuning in. I hope you've enjoyed our presentation today. Be sure to check out our chart of the day every day at investedcentral.com. While you're there, sign up for our free weekly Market Pulse newsletter and have the chart of the day emailed directly to you. Happy trading.